I won't ask what's up with you, and you won't ask what's up with me. Deal. Deal. You want to buy me a drink? Where was I? Uh, he had his head the whole way out the window. Right, yeah. I pulled over, his friends got him out. Got on the door and the window, but seat and the carpets were fine. <laughs> okay, fuck no. Not gonna drive drunk people around. No, no way. Pay's okay. Basically my full-time job. I mean, that's cool, but what do you want to be when you grow up? Um, so we had a deal. Yeah, I, I know, but... <sighs> Sorry, you don't have to tell me. Let's just change the subject. Travel writer. Travel writer? Yeah. My mom was a travel writer. She was gone a lot. I don't know, I guess I just figure whatever's out there must be pretty important. So, why haven't you? Turns out I don't like to travel. I've always wanted to go live on a kibbutz. Are you Jewish? No, but you don't have to be Jewish. Don't you? No, I don't think so. <laughs> I just like the idea that everybody does a job, and while you're there, that's what your life is. No questions, no surprises. Your life is your life, even if your life is about planting crops. Nice. So, what do you say? Want to go live on a kibbutz with me? <laughs> You're sweet. You're cute. Really? How? I'm going. Please don't go. Elise, wait! This has been happening to me every night for the past 11 years. Every night without fail. And it always happens at exactly the same time. First to see it. I wish I had it.
Javi, Alec. We guess that. You don't you don't have to call me back. It's okay. It's been a while since I um I guess let my guard down like that. I'm sorry. I I don't know what this thing is. I don't know where I go or how I get back. I can't record video or sound. I've just been... I've just been living with this thing because... <laughs> Who would I tell? After 11 years, I don't even really know much about it. I don't know what would happen with someone else here. I actually, I don't know what happened to you. I've never seen it. I've been living with this thing so long, I've forgotten what it's like to be scared of it. I should not have had to have gone through that. I'm so, I am so sorry. Especially because you're the first person who's ever made me forget about it. years. And uh, last night was the first time I didn't think of it. Thank you for that. It's worth I guess, I guess that's it. What the fuck?